Hey, good morning. Chuck here with Apple Drains. Today we're replacing a sump pump down in a crawl space here at this house. It takes about 15 minutes and uh, we're going to show you exactly how you do that. So we're replacing a sump pump. You can see all the water that's you know back through that line that's from the check valve. I'm going to go ahead and pull that pump out. Old pump burn out. Now we need to open up our box. So we're setting up the Zoller M53 male inch and a half threaded adapter. The little hole that it belongs in. <laughs> Screwed in there good and tight. Just with your hand. Because we need a measurement from the discharge of the pump up to our check valve right here. And make a measurement. Go ahead and mark that spot with your finger check and make a good cut. It's going to be right at the top of that coupling. Make a good mark. So now we're going to glue up the riser, stick that into the, the male inch and a half threaded discharge of the pump. Good. Keep it down at the bottom. Good. Okay. Let's stick it down in the pump into our discharge section. Push it, twist it, set the pump down into the pet, and you line it up. Perfect. Now we're putting our check valve together. Good and tight. Good. That's good. Now we need another clamp for the bottom section of our no hub right here. This is inch and a half to inch and a quarter and we have to adapt to this because this is inch and a quarter pipe that they've run here. Remember this is a sump pump replacement. Perfect. Now use your handy dandy drill with a 5 16 inch bit and you tighten it up. Make sure you're square, it's not tight yet, make sure you're square into the slot that it belongs. It takes a little bit of practice to get this right. Once you do it, it's a piece of cake. There's two clamps to hold your no hub. Tighten them both up. Good and tight. That's it. Remember that the check valve only allows water to flow one direction up. As it sits in this pipe up here, it won't come back down and, and spin the impeller backwards. So let's go ahead and plug that pump in. So we've got it plugged in and you can see the water level going down very quickly. And it's just lifting it up through the check valve, coming out through the pipe and going outside. You can actually hear some of the debris. This is an effluent pump, which means that it can lift up solids up to a half an inch and it just pushes them right through there, no problem at all. Hey, this is Chuck with Apple Drains, reminding you that if you believe you can do something, I guarantee you can do it. Have a great day. Hey, good morning, Chuck here at Apple Drains. You can see we've got some crew here, we got some pipe, heading over to the checkout, we're at Lowe's. These people. Well, we can't, no, we can't tell those people that. We can't check no, out over here at the self out. check Everything's out. Everything's free today. Everything's free today. I'm just joking. I'll tackle you and run out the door. That that would be that would be so cool. <laughs>